This week's featured Penrith Solar Centre install is at Silverdale, New South Wales. This project is led by team leader and CEC accredited electrician Bryce and his crew of Rory and Kobe. Featured in today's video, our crew will be installing and levelling our Schleder racking system, discussing the panel orientation on this project to suit the roof and shade, and an insight into what it's like installing on a cathedral ceiling. Let's get started. This design here, we've gone with a landscape design, uh, mainly because of the screw lines didn't suit a portrait, um, allowing the clamp zones to be in specification. We've centered this array to this roof space, mainly because of the trees surrounding this uh, premises. Uh, it's the clearest spot, allowing the panels to get the most production. On the other space here, we've also centered it so it looks nice and presentable for the client. Also, it suits the shading allowing it to get the most production. This project consists of 26 Trina 440 watt N-type solar panels and 26 N-phase IQ8 micro inverters, all tied together on all black Schleder racking. Once the feet and rail are installed, it's time to level the rail. We do this using a string line. This process starts with setting the heights at each end of the array. The tension in the string line creates a straight line which we use as a reference to set the height of each intermediate piece of rail on the array. Once the rail is lifted to the string line, it's locked off at the correct height so that the array is perfectly level and straight. Here's our installers installing the microinverters to the rail and completing the earthing and terminations. Installing solar on a cathedral ceiling has its challenges when trying to conceal the cable run from the switchboard to the roof. Here's Bryce explaining how we managed to conceal the cable run for this project. We've also pushed this array as high as possible because this half here is cathedral, allowing us to access the roof space and the cables over up top. And then the rain appeared. For safety reasons, work had to stop several times throughout the day. Once the sun eventually reappeared, the boys dried off and now we're ready to start throwing panels. 